Amongst the natural landscape of hills and lakes, the National Chemical Laboratory, or NCL, was established in 1950 in Pune. Spread over a sprawling campus of nearly 500 acres, it was declared open on January 3, 1950 by the then Honourable Prime Minister of India, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. A constituent laboratory of the Council of Scientific and Industrial Research, or CSIR, which is one of the world's largest publicly funded R&D organisations, NCL has a staff strength of over 1,600, including about 300 research scientists, many of them with postdoctoral qualifications from abroad. In addition, NCL also has a large number of students pursuing their PhD programs. NCL is today rated internationally as a world-class R&D institution, known for its excellence in the areas of catalysis, polymer science, organic chemistry, chemical engineering sciences, inorganic materials, nanotechnology and biochemical sciences. The catalysis research at NCL covers both heterogeneous and homogeneous catalysis aimed at developing innovative catalysts in the areas of petrochemicals, organic intermediates and fine chemicals. With world-class expertise in catalytic materials like zeolites, metallosilicates, metal oxides and other mesoporous materials ranging from catalyst design, synthesis and characterization, the Catalysis Group has competencies in reactions involving halogenation, acylation, oxidation, alkylation and nitration. The Catalyst Pilot Plant, which can scale up and optimize the catalyst know-how developed at NCL, can manufacture the catalysts where 50 to 100 kg solid catalyst can be produced per batch and supplied to companies for catalyst testing purposes. The homogeneous catalysis group with expertise in soluble metal complexes, supported metal catalysts, biphasic catalysis and multiphase catalytic systems has extensive experience in handling gases like oxygen, hydrogen and carbon monoxide under high pressure and temperature conditions. The laboratories are well equipped with a variety of micro to macro scale stirred pressure reactors, fixed bed catalytic reactors, trickle bed and continuous stirred tank reactors carrying out research on industrially important reactions involving carbonylation, oxidative carbonylation, hydroformylation, amination, hydrogenation and liquid phase oxidation. The group has extensive competencies in kinetic modeling, analysis of multiphase catalytic systems and development of reactor performance models. The polymer science and engineering research at NCL encompasses expertise in the areas of polymer chemistry, novel drug delivery systems, complex fluids and polymer engineering, polymer processing, polymer modeling, conducting polymers, nanofillers, photopolymers and membrane sciences. The complex fluids and rheology group investigates structure and dynamics in materials and translates this understanding to develop structure-property relationships for polymers, foods, gels, surfactants and colloidal solutions. The laboratory has state-of-the-art rheology equipment coupled with in-situ optical tools for structural characterization that allow measurements in shear and elongational flow. The Polymer Processing Center is a unique facility among the academic and research institutions in India. The centre is equipped with pilot-scale polymer processing and mechanical characterization facilities such as the DSM microcompounder, microinjection moulding machine, burst-off twin-screw extruder, hack polylab, Instron UTM and assessed Izod impact tester. The Membrane Science and Technology Group has developed and patented a flat-sheet ultrafiltration membrane which has pores small enough to exclude pathogenic species like virus and bacteria, yet porous enough to be able to operate at tap water pressure. The concept, which has wide applications in the domestic and rural sector, is in commercial production today. The group also has state-of-the-art characterization facilities such as gel permeation chromatographs, photon correlation spectrophotometers, polarizing optical microscopes, ultramicrotone, HPLC, FTIR, thermal analyzers and dynamic mechanical analyzer. 
The Organic Chemistry and Technology Group is engaged in new drug development programs, process chemistry, custom synthesis, synthesis of new chemical entities with clinical potential, isolation of natural products and evaluation of bioactivity besides organic chemicals research and development. The group has competencies in the areas of asymmetric synthesis, biocatalytic transformations, execution of multi-step organic synthesis, carbohydrate chemistry, color chemistry and scale-up capabilities up to kilogram level. The bioorganic and biomimetic chemistry group is involved with interfacing synthetic organic chemistry with biological and materials chemistry to develop novel therapeutic, diagnostic and functional materials. Expertise also exists in structural chemistry to explore phenomena such as polymorphism, crystallization and crystal habits. The Combinatorial Chemistry Bioresource Center aims for development of compound libraries for lead discovery, processing of medicinal plants based on activity, bioassays for high throughput screening, new targets for HDS assay developments, new molecular scaffolds as inhibitors of specific disease targets designed using chemoinformatics. The center is equipped with a high throughput screening system, CEP box, parallel synthesizer, HD evaporation system, accelerated solvent extractor and a simulated moving bed chromatography system. The center is expected to accelerate discoveries of new lead compounds and utilization of the vast natural biodiversity of India for value-added products. The Chemical Engineering Division seeks to exploit the fundamental